Today, you must call me Captain Sparkles. What is going on guys? My name is Echo and welcome to episode 3 of my Minecraft Xbox Texture Pack review. Yes, we are Mr. Captain Sparkles and we are using the lovely OCD Texture Pack. Now, I love this Texture Pack. I have OCD and this is just perfect for me. We are also in the very, 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 very old tutorial world. Hit that like button if you remember it. So every time I hit 1,000 likes, on these episodes, I will bring you guys a brand new episode and also leave a comment down below on a texture pack and a skin I should be checking out in the next episode. Now, I've had a lot of requests for the real life texture pack. I am currently working on doing that. However, it's a little bit more difficult and requires a little bit more work, so I couldn't get it done in time for today's video. But nonetheless, OCD texture pack guys, if you've never seen it, it is possibly one of the best texture packs that you could possibly have in Minecraft and it's just so wonderful. Um, again, I'm just going to be showing you in much detail. I'll start off in survival and then we will head into creative. We have a whole bunch of things around here. I don't remember too much the... Oh, oh we got a boot! Oh yeah, guys, you will notice that some of the items are still of the faithful texture pack. Ignore that. Some of the um, texture packs such as OCD, they generally use the default texture pack items. Um, so I didn't change that back anyway. I just wanted to explain that to you. But we have a cow. I changed the animals. I'm hoping that they did change. There's not much difference on the OCD texture pack cows or on the sheep. It's more the pigs. So I'm going to try and find some pigs. And hello, Mr. Sheep. Come here. Hello. Hi. I'm going to have to kill you because if I if it gets to nighttime, then I'm going to need some wool to, to, to make a, a bed. Come here. Whoa. That... That's a ninja cow. A ninja, a ninja cow. A ninja sheep. Alright, so we got one there. Anyway, the reason why I like this is because, look, if I go to a tree and I start to mine it, it has a bar on when it's going to break. I think that is so, so cool. It's the same for, for grass. You can see here, it has like the, the bar when it's going to, it kind of looks like a battery, the battery life. Um, but you can break it and it just, so, it just shows you when you're going to break it, which is absolutely great for the things like obsidian and the harder things to break. It's exactly the same for for this, it's exactly the, the same for this. You can see how long it's gonna take and it works with a pickaxe as well. So we make a pickaxe real quick. I'm gonna quickly make a pickaxe and show you guys exactly what I mean. So if I turn these into this, we're gonna make the um, the crafting table here. I'm gonna turn this into, we're gonna make some sticks real quick and I'm gonna, I need to, I need to get a little bit more. Let's just get a little bit more. I wanna show you guys, let's just go and get a tree. That would be a lot easier. Um, but this texture pack has been requested quite a lot and I know a lot of you have been requesting it along with the Captain Sparkle skin. A lot of you guys did request this as well over the three episodes, so I thought, why not do it today? Why not check it out? So we're going to quickly make um, a pickaxe. I want to show you guys what I'm talking about. As you can see, it is slightly still a faithful. Um, this happens, but you'll see even when I go to break here, it is just a, a loading bar as well. I think it's just so, so cool. I, I really do love this texture pack a lot, I and mean, a lot of you requested for it, so I wanted to do it. Um, I'm going to show you guys everything in much detail anyway, so let's head on from here. I do have my water alone. As you can see there, it's breaking. Let me quickly eat my watermelon. Let's go and check out the old tutorial world because I cannot remember the last time I visited this. It was, well, a long, long time ago. Um, oh, we got a music disc. We got, oh, we got, we got, we got an arrow. All right, then I forgot about these. I, I generally forgot what this world does have. Um, but let's go and check out the rest of it. I know there's some food somewhere, but you can see here that these are the bushes. We will go and check out. Let's go and check out the farm. I think the farm is this way. I, I think it is. Yes, it is. It is. It is. Uh, we've got more sheep here. Unfortunately, sheep. I need, I'm going to, I'm going to have to kill you because <laughs> I'm going to need wool in case it turns to night time. Um, but we will switch to creative anyway. And in creative, I'll show you all the blocks, all the ores and all the cool things like that. Come here, Mr. Gal. Come here. There we go. All right. So we've got two. There's one more here. They're simply waiting for me. There we go. I'm sorry, my friend. I need you more than you need you, if that makes any sense. Uh, we've got pigs. The pigs, can you can tell that the pigs have been changed in this texture pack because they're just completely plain with, well, the little swirl on the on the back for their tail, which is good. Um, let's see what else we can check out here. I'm trying to remember as much as I can. I know, oh, I forgot about this. This is the, what is this? Is this sugar cake? No, that's the wheat. We've got the wheat here. Um, you can also do this here, which is like farming. Let's just put some stuff away. Let's put that in there, down there, down there. Let's farm. Let's place some, some wheat down. Let's do this. One, two, three, four, five. I think that's right. Oh, we got 13. All right, let's just do five. One, two, three, four, five. So everything literally is perfect in this texture pack. And if you suffer from OCD like me, then you're going to be like, yeah, this is awesome. I know a lot of people would love to see this on Minecraft console edition. Um, however, I don't know if they're ever going to introduce it. I would love for them to introduce it. For, for sure, because I think it's one of the greatest texture packs ever introduced. And I love the, the wall as well. So in a minute, I'm just going to switch over to creative. I remember this survival. This, this tutorial world so, so much. I really, really do. So let's switch over to creative so I can show you guys all the rest of the blocks and more. 
All right, so welcome back to the creative version of the OCD texture pack. We are back in the gates of a mortal map because I have all of these blocks in the item frames. Not only that, it does have a whole different combination of blocks that have been used for design. So I'm gonna show you a whole bunch of things in this uh, texture pack today, but you can see all the blocks on the wall. We've got the likes of um, the ores, we've got the likes of slabs. Instead of me going over it like this, I'm just gonna grab a whole bunch and literally show you as many as I can in this texture pack to start off with. Um, let's place down just a normal block of stone here. We've got the likes of grass, we've got the likes of dirt again. The, oh, we're in creative, so it's not gonna show you the, the, the loading. We've got the cobblestone, the sand, the sandstone, the block of gold. What else do we have here? We've got a whole bunch here. I love this texture pack so much, I really do. Uh, block of iron, the lapis lazuli, the block of diamond, coal ore, lapis ore, diamond ore, redstone ore, iron ore, and of course, of course the gold ore. I, I think the ores look great in this texture pack as well. What else should we check out? The wood. The wood is always something a lot of people like to see. Uh, that's bedrock there. Uh, let's check out this as well. So we're going to start off with this. This is just, I think it's just mossy cobblestone. It is, as you can see there. We've got the bedrock. So you'll know when you hit bedrock. We've got the nether brick slab. We've got the um, stone brick slab, the brick slabs, the cobblestone slabs, the wood birch slab, the spruce slab, the oak slab. What else have we got here? Um, I'm trying to figure out everything that's here. What's this? Oh, this is the end stone. Ooh. The end stone looks very impressive. I don't think the end of dragon's chains, but we might go and check out the nether and the end. What's this? What is this block? Oh, that's obsidian. Okay. Uh, what else do we got here? We've got the grass itself. We've got the vines. We've got a whole bunch of these. I want to show you guys as much as I can. You see, the more you get to see, the better it will be spruce. Oh, I like the spruce one. We've got the vines, which you can place on top of there. Red wool, orange wool, yellow wool, bookshelf. There's so many things in this texture pack that I do like. Um, oh, we got the... Let's see what they look like on my face. Let's see what this pumpkin looks like. Oh, it hasn't changed. <laughs> that looks so weird. <laughs> Captain Sparkles is no more. We are now Pumpkin Man. Or Pumpkin Sparkles, should I say. Alright, let's get rid of that so you guys can still see things in better detail here. We've got the Jack-O-Lantern. Um, some of these things are still the same as Faithful, like I told you. Let's grab this, 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 and this. Uh, let's grab this. So we've got here a chest. The chest has changed. We've got a crafting table or the crafting bench. We've got the furnaces. We've got the brewing stand. The enchantment table, which I think is very impressive. We've got the end portal frames. We've got the jukebox. We've got the fences. Another fences. What else have we got here that I need to show you guys? Um, all right, we're just going to go and explore. It's kind of a little bit of an explore. So I can show you guys what it looks like um, because this map, again, more broken doors. Look, at this is what your house would look like as a, as a basic example of how you could design your house like this. I think it looks so impressive. I really like this texture pack. I, I probably said that so many times throughout this episode, but I really do. I am so impressed with it. I, I've never actually enjoyed a texture pack in such a long time. I like these ones. I prefer these types of texture packs over the HD ones because, oh, it's a skeleton. The skeleton has changed. I think the skeleton's changed. Um, it just looks very similar to default. Oh, there's a, there's a burning furnace. I wonder if there's anything inside there. There is nothing inside there. We're just going to... Okay then, we're just not gonna do nothing. Um, so overall, I wanna leave, I want you guys to leave a comment on every single video or every single episode on, on, on what you give these texture packs out of 10. Um, don't forget the resolution on console is, I think it's 16 or I can sometimes do 32 times 32 texture packs, which as we did do faceful. Um, but some of them, some of them do look terrible. The HD ones, if I try and break them down from like, I don't know, 124 or, or like 64 times times 64 because console version isn't built for that it really isn't maybe if i could do it on xbox one like this we could have the cool hd ones but you can see here that these are the farms um and i just think overall this is a great texture pack so apart from that guys it's been a lovely adventure with captain sparkles who has been our assistant in today's episode um let me know what you do think about this let me know what you think about the oc texture pack let me know what your favorite features about this texture pack and let me know what texture pack and what skin you would like me to do in the next episode at 1000 likes i will release the next episode have a great day, as always, and I'll catch you next time. Bye! Oh yeah, guys, tonight's live stream will be a little bit late, but I do plan to stream around about 10.30 p.m. UK time, which is 5.30 p.m. US EST, and I'll catch you there. Bye!